So guess what? My new dishwasher is here. Let's unbox it. So with the dishwasher, I received another box, a tiny box full of the accessories for the dishwasher. Let's unbox it. Let's see what I received in the box. Ah, so first, I've received the manual. The manual to how to fix your dishwasher, especially if you fix it next to your washing machine. The steps are right here. I also receive a special tab that you can fix your washing machine and dishwasher next to each other. Really good, huh? Oh, and an output hose that you can fix for your dishwasher and also washing machine which is next to each other. Oh, last but not least, we also receive a one kilo of detergent for your dishwasher. Amazing! So this is the warranty card and the manual for the dishwasher. For the warranty card, you need to register at toshiba.com.my So now, we're going to go and install the dishwasher. Let's go! So this is the outlet hose. This is the inlet hose. And this is the power cord. So first, you will remove this. And then you take the inlet hose and fix it here and tick clockwise. You just have to turn it. So 
once that's done, you take the outlet hose and you put it into the drainage hole. Huh, just like that. Then you take the power cord and fix it to the plug. All done. Whew, that was easy. So if you want to know more of how to fix the dishwasher next to the washing machine, please scan this QR code. So if you guys want to know how to use the dishwasher, follow me and I'll show you guys the steps. So first you have to do is remove this tray from the dishwasher. Step one, we are supposed to add special salt into the salt dispenser. But in Malaysia, we don't really have to use this step as our water supply is soft water. But in other countries, we need to use this step because their water supply is hard water. So, we don't need this step. Step 2, we need to add the rims aid into this part of the dispenser because it's going to help you to dry the dishes faster. we will add the washing tablet into this part of the dispenser and this is how the washing tablet looks like and you just put it in here like this or you can also use the washing powder into this once it's done you just close it simple like that step four you will have to remove all the food residue off the plate so if you guys want to know how to place your dishes in the dishwasher, first of all, let me show you. This placement, it's wrong. Why? Because the water won't flow and clean the dirty dishes. Each of the plates needs its own room. This is how you do it. This, it's right. Now, for the bowl. Ha, this bowl, it is wrong. Why is the placement wrong? Because the dirty water is going to store in it and it will not clean your bowl. So what you have to do is, you have to incline it downwards. As for the chopping board. This is not the right placement. This is wrong. Why? Let me show you. The spring arm it will not clean it, it will not help to clean, it will block it. So what you have to do is, you have to put your chopping board at the side. And push the tray back in. Now you see, the spray arm works. Ta-da! So, this is how you place your dishes the right way. For the fifth step, all you have to do is place the dishes into the tray and push it in. So now you guys see or not, the space between the lower rack and the above rack. So little. So if you have heavy pots, big pots you want to put on the lower rack, all you have to do is, to create more space, let me show you. First, you pull out the upper tray. And then, you lift this handle up and let it go and then you push it back in. So now you guys see the space that you have created to put your big pots on the lower tray. For the last step, all you have to do is close the dishwasher, turn on the power button, pick the washing program of your preference, and press the play button. Ta-da! This is how magic is done. By end of the day, you're going to have clean dishes. For this dishwasher DW14F1S-MY, we have so many features that you can use on a daily basis, such as hygiene, eco, auto daily, and much more. Let's see the features that we have. 
for auto daily, light to heavily soiled daily use items, automatic detection of the amount of soil. For hygiene, used to remove bacteria from your dishes and glassware. Maintains the water temperature at 70 degrees Celsius. For Eco, this is a standard program for general dirty dishes and utensils, such as pots, plates, glasses and pans. 90 minutes for normally soiled load that needs quick wash. For glass, for slightly dirty dishes and glasses. For rapid, for slightly dirty dishes, the required cleaning time is relatively short. There you see, we have so many features for this dishwasher that you can use. And for the parents out there with little toddlers, not to worry, this dishwasher has child lock. With this dishwasher, it will save me time, money and my water bill. For example, if I give you one ringgit, would you want to wash my dirty dishes? How about I give you five ringgit, would you still want to wash my dirty dishes? Forget about it, I will just let my best friend do it. Because with the hygiene program, it will only cost me 53 cents. With my best friend, I only use 10 litres of water. But if I hand washed, I would have used 10 times more water than I used with my dishwasher. So which one would you choose? Who needs the dishwasher? For example, people like me. Why? Because I'm always busy. I'm always on the go. I do not have time to wash all my dishes. Big families as well need dishwasher because they have so many people living under one roof. Not to forget even small families. Why? Because their parents are always working till late. So yeah, that is why you need the dishwasher because it's easy and convenient. Imagine having a small kitchen or even a small sink and you have so many people washing the dishes. See? Do you guys really want to know why you need the dishwasher? Because it's healthy, clean, convenient and water saving. What plates, pots, glasses and pans can be washed and what cannot be washed. Washing powder and the washing tablets, you will need it every time you use the dishwasher. As for the rinse aid, you will only need it every two to three weeks. Where can you get them? You can get them at selected supermarkets or you can scan this QR code. For cleaning and care, first hold the coarse filter and rotate it anti-clockwise to unlock the filter. Lift the filter upwards and out of the dishwasher. Step 2. 
The cost filter can be detached from the main filter by gently squeezing the tabs at the top and pulling it away. The fine filter can be pulled off the bottom of the filter assembly. Step 3. Larger foot remnants can be cleaned by rinsing the filter under running water. For more thorough clean, use a soft cleaning brush. For step 4, reassemble the filters in the reverse order of the disassembly, replace the filter insert and rotate clockwise to close the arrow. I would like to give you guys a few tips. But the first tip is that if you guys have additional dishes you want to put into the dishwasher while it's washing, all you need to do is press the pause button to pause the washing program and then wait for 5 seconds, open the door, add the additional dishes into it, close the door, press the start button, wait for 10 seconds and the dishwasher will start again. Tips 2. What if there's an electricity outage? Hmm, not to worry because once the electricity comes back, the dishwasher will automatically resume. For the third tip, how if you get a phone call and you need to head out in 30 minutes but your dishwasher is still running with all your dishes? Not to worry, all you need to do is press the pause button to pause the washing program and then Press and hold the program button for more than 3 seconds and you'll enter into standby mode. Then what you do is, you press the program button and pick your desired program to shorten the length of your washing time. Lastly, all you need to do is press the start button and after 10 seconds, your dishwasher will start running again. For the fourth tip, how if you have dishes that are not completely dry? Not to worry, all you have to do is open the dishwasher door, leave it for 30 minutes and it will be completely dry. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Look at my plate, it is so clean. Clean plate makes me happy. This is why I can't live without my best friend, dishwasher DW14F1S-MY. It's literally my best friend forever.